Let's continue styling our navigation drawing here. So instead of just this white one, we want the one similar to the others where we have our primary up here and we have the last one here would be our admin one, right? So we just for now gonna put our about to the bottom instead. First thing, go into navigation, scroll a little bit up and where we have our draw right here, this is just a white background. I want the gray one we used in the one I had. And since we already set up our um, our themes, we can just use the one we already have here. So we can call the primary color from our, um, oh, you can see there's two windows. I don't know why there's two windows open, doesn't matter. So now this one is gray tone, right? And these were white and we had different colors for the icons and so on and so on. That's excellent. So next thing we wanna do is we wanna scroll down to our, scroll down is right here for me at least, uh, my, navigation here and if I look at my code for this I'm just gonna right click this here and inspect this one over here I'm gonna hover and I can see this is called uh, diff class and navigation and inside I have the UL and the outer layer is called what is, is it I mean the wrong one uh, it doesn't matter this is the nav one uh, oh there we go nav at data so we want to use the selector called nav and then inside this we want to call the UL the LIs and so on and so on right is this the same one? It is the same one. I'm just going to use this one then. Excellent. In here, let's start with NAV and UL first. So this is the easy one. Uh, we, I've done this many, many times in many different videos, so this will be fairly fast. So we want some padding, we want some margin to move it around. And yes, I did this before, so I know exactly what to write. And the text decoration, we want to remove that. Uh, so we don't have any um, lines under because it's a link and so on. That's all we want for the URL. URL, the UL, and then we want to add some code to the list. I'm gonna scroll down a little bit more. And in this one, we want to use a color. And since we set up our uh, navigation, our SAS maps, I wanna use those. I wanna use the map get here. And I wanna attach this to the color with a set, colors. And yeah, colors with the C if you speak American, I don't know. Um, and in here, I want to use uh, the orange one, so the color of orange, or the color of the orange variable at least. Cool. And more to this, we want to add a little bit uh, to the margin left. We can just do those first. These here, I want to add 15%. I want to add a semicolon up here so we don't get an error. That's going to be great. And in this one, I want to add some padding. Uh, let's add five pixels, 20, so we use the merging, so five from top and bottom and 20 on each side. So let's see what this does to our design right now. So it moves them around a little bit, right? We still have the buttons here. But now we have this one here, this one here is pretty. Woohoo! So let's remove the list style. So we don't have those list style type, none. If I can spell right, that's cool. Oops, not that one, just save, and there we go. And as you can see here, like you know, used to with navigation, when you hover over something, they get this little hand you can click, right? So the cursor icon or pointer or whatever it's called. Um, we're gonna add this because apparently that's removed from here. So cursor pointer, let's add this to our code. So let's see what that does. Now we have the little hand thingy and when you click it, we switch still. Woo, that's great. Next thing I wanna do is I just wanna change a little bit how everything looks. So let's start with our nav and li and the icon, right? That's the, the one we have in here. And I just wanna do a margin right on this one to move it a little bit. Oops, uh, one is not a lot, uh, 10. So the margin just is a little bit more uh, space between these two elements here. Then I want to uh, do or move this about us to the bottom of the page. So if you remember, I had the admin down here, so it's not part of the normal menu, sort of. Um, so let's do one of those. So we're gonna use the nav li, um, and it's only the last, in our case, it's only the last item that we want to be moved to the, the bottom of the navigation drawer. So we're just gonna use the last child selector, or pseudo here, not selector. So the last pseudo CSS, last child pseudo, uh, and in here we are going to use position and we're going to use absolute. And then we're gonna tell it go from bottom, we wanted to move it 40 pixel up. Uh, so this would be zero and then move it 40 pixel up by using this uh, method here. And we wanna switch the colors a little bit again because eh, we can. 
and we're going to use the map get. We're going to grab the color, and the color will be in progress. In progress, like so. So let's save and see what this does. So now this is the light orange glow. We have our header up here with our navigate, well, our header. And we can also style uh, our icons for different colors if we want to. We can either do this um, in our CSS or we can add them straight to this one. I want to do up here because since we're using both CSSS, we can also use the, the inline, the, the colors from Beautify. So I'm going to do this up here. And the first one I want for home, I just want it to be the orange. Oh, orange. So this should fit with, whoop, it didn't change. Mm, it's because I do it in the wrong place. Sorry. I want to put it into the icon. There we go. So that switches the colors of the icon, right? Same with this one down here. This one I just want to be, uh, where do you go? The color of the icon. Let's switch it to the same as down here. That was in progress. In progress. And this should be the yellow one. So now we style this and every time we add a new uh, list item into a navigation, it's going to pop up here and the last item. Uh, so if we add another one, your bot would pop up here. And if I add it after this, it will of course go down here. But if I add it before about, you know what I'm getting at. Sweet. So now we style our uh, navigation drawer here and ready to continue with the rest of the site.